This is like yep. StarCraft APM happening right here. <laughs> That's the Peach Daisy players. They have to like break their controllers to do all their <laughs> all their movement mix-ups and all of their like kill combos. Mm -hmm. Well, gonna see how this goes in game one. Yippy diddly do versus Sora J. Yep, we'll see. I feel like he's definitely gonna pull. A Sora J also known for pulling a lot of you know stitch turnips as well. Oh, yeah. he immediately catches the tech chase there. Oh, I like that side beat, just going back straight to center stage. Yeah. They get beefy through the, the arm there as well. Yeah, so far, Yippy is uh, yet to really be able to put any percentage on. Yeah, I love the range that Sora J is playing at right now because he's not playing like in Min Min's like arm range, he's <laughs> playing like right above it to where Amarix has to, or Yippy Dealy Do has to. Oh, he has no jump. He might be dead here. Oh, oh gonna miss the turnip. Miss yeah. the turnip. Oh, I, oh, like, I like the drop, I like the drop. Yeah, it was kind of an interesting option. It went for the Z drop on the turn up too, but it did pass through the iframes. Yep. Oh, okay. Gonna be able to air dodge the laser. Yeah, if he hit that, it might have been a lot of damage for Sora J. I think this is gonna be an interesting set too, because I oh. think either player could die at almost any percentage as well. The the stocks could potentially be taken whenever. Um, all yep. Yippy has to do is be off stage for Sora J to just hit him with the turn up or something like that. But Similarly, Min Min takes stocks so early, sometimes with that Dragon Laser. Yep. And uh, Yippie's definitely somebody who, who does that. Yeah, just like you said, this very volatile matchup. Yeah. Yippie Dilly do. Yeah, it was about 80 to 90% almost unanswered um, from Sora J to start this off, but Yippie's the one who takes the stock first. Yeah. I think, Sor I think he's starting to catch on where Sora J is. Positioning himself more for Mimic. Oh, what's the? Oh my God! Oh, I, I was not ready. For, I was not ready for that. <laughs> yeah, that was a, a really well played from Sora J. Oh yeah, Go, he's really good with turnips in general. Just hell, I think that's a, no, that's a stack. Yeah, that's a stock. That's the, that's the turnip right there. Yeah, with the powered up arms as well from that grab. Uh, just really well played from Yippy. Yeah, those power, those powered up arms are doing so much work for him. Oh, oh my God, almost he almost took it died. right there. If he got hit by the laser, he would have. That would have been spelled disaster for him. But Yippy Diddly Do is running away with this lead right now, yeah. playing so well around Peach and just weaving around with Min Min and using her arms to it's just stuff out Peach in general. It's yeah, and Yippy is a really good momentum player too. As soon as he has that advantage state, is just going to push it to try and take that stock as early as possible. Yeah. Um, but Sora J. Oh, I. I thought Sora J maybe had an opportunity there, but immediately Yippy turned it around. Yeah, both these players are very uh, momentum oriented as well. I feel like Sora J gets a if he gets a good combo here and pulls a pulls like a clutch turn up here, he might be able to take the stock at like thirty percent. Yeah, could oh. even could even it up. Oh wait, big Here's damage the combo. Yep, Yippy off stage. Good jump there for. It was a very good wait. I feel like that fair was also going to hit the ledge because of Min Min really bad ledge hang. Okay, Sora J, gonna be trying to get back on the le uh, stage and does. Oh no, oh he's fine. This is, uh, it's oh so tense God. right now. Yep. Uh, with Good. up smash is gonna be a little bit more damage and another oh. bad spot for Yippy. Turn, cat recatches the turn up here. And oh, he catches him dashing back, but he's not dead. Oh, wait, hold, oh he's dead. That's yeah, it. Yep. that's it, that's there it, that turn up's gonna Cat take it. Catches the tether recovery. Yeah, these Both of these players are just so momentum oriented. Sora J was just able to get one combo and just convert it into damage after damage. Yeah, extremely volatile. It looked like it kept going back and forth, but players even trading ledge and trading stage, trading uh, who's an advantage and who can try and trap. But yeah. it was that turn up because Min Min just really hard to get back to stage, really linear kind of recovery. Yeah, um, if you sni sniper recovery doesn't exactly like have a lot of range either. And her airspeed is just, her air acceleration is really f slow. So if she just gets hit once, she might just be dead without her jump. Yeah. And just, yeah. Going into game two, uh, PS2 is going to be the option again. No counter pick or anything like that. Uh, oh. Saying it's not the stage's fault, but oh, oh my, my god. Oh, he's going deep. That oh, might dead? be it. Oh, no, 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 no. Gonna be just in range to be able to oh, link back there. to ledge. Yeah, I like I like the jump there for Sora J because if he if he didn't press a button there, he might have just died to mid mid. Oh, that's damage though. 
Yeah, Yippy played that really well, and all in kind of boxing range as well. Uh, not opting to go to full yeah. range for the arms, just just playing up close and personal. Some yeah, scrapping. Amar Amaris is very good with scrapping with Min Min. Like yeah. he's a very he's very aggressive Min Min player, more so than most Min Mins, where he just throw out arms the entire time. Yeah, but I catch, agree. Catches the double jump there. Okay, gonna be able to make a watt. Uh, get Sora J off of him and all the way on the other side to re uh, reset neutral. And both players just about 100% uh, yeah, percent, a little bit above. Definitely a kill percent here for Sora J, especially with the Megawatt just being very, very scary for him. But Sora J, just, once again, he's just playing outside of Min Min's like, range because she can't get the... Oh, oh yeah, just the float uh, the board around. Yeah. Good grab there. Going for got, the Mega Watch, but the power got slow. Arms. A little bit. Oh, I, I think the down smash would have killed there, but. Yeah, I was going to say up smash. I like smash yeah. too. But. Positioning for dash attack, but he's still able to catch the neutral get up with the, the arm there. Yeah, either way, uh, back to even again. He has the, the link. I think he has the link here. Link guy there. Oh, that might do Let's a lot see. of damage if he gets a lot. That's going to be thrown away. That was a really, really clean up there, there for Amarix. Ledge trap position, but the ring not going to hit. Uh, Sword J able to shield in time. Oh, both of them living yeah. each other's down tilts there. Kind of interesting with Yippy landing on shield a lot, but going for down uh, down tilt a lot, just sliding right into that shield. Mimmin, Mimmins love those down tilts where, because it, it gives her just the amount of range where it crosses up shield while also being like a good burst movement option. Yeah. A good, yeah. a good, oh, I landed on their shield. I got to do something. Pretty much. Sort of option. And that uh, yeah, Nair they're, is going to take it. Nair trade favoring Yippie Diddly Doo there. Megawatt Nair is so strong. Oh yeah. It's kind of it's kind of an absurdly strong move. It's not that much slower. Yeah, very diable though. Like you're, yeah. If, if you're able to not get hit by like the the good hitbox of it, you can hold like down and away, and it can not kill at like 135, something like that. All right, Sora J, uh, trying to press up against Min Min, but. Yeah. This is kind of where you can get into trouble. Uh, Ooh, I like the counter yeah. there. Good counter. And it had just about a rich. Oh, it's a stitch. Oh, yeah. no. Stitch face. Not necessarily he... the time that he oh, needs he... it, right? Yep. I, I think a stitch face is maybe a little bit better at early percent. Yep. But he also could just throw it just to, you know, kill if he diddly do. Sure. But I think he just needs to get this kill move and that, then he's going to turn into. He's going to turn the momentum into his favor. Yeah, we saw this last game. Uh, Sora J was still able to win from a similar position. Yep. Um, he, needs to get, he just needs to get in on Yippie Diddly Doo, but he's still doing a good job of just boxing him out and juggling him as well. I like the parry just to reposition there. Yeah. And oh, off stage again, but nice. Yippie able to get back, and it's going to be a back throw. That was a good grab. Arms are powered up. Going really high there, but Sora J is not ready for it. But Megawatt, very slow, just catches the neutral get up there. Min Min Lead Trapping, very, very good for Yippie Diddly Doo there. It just lingers, right? It, the Megawatt, it's slow, it's, but it sort of lingers in that kind of neutral get up spot. It ling yeah, it lingers like just the right amount mm -hmm. of time to where it ca it catch neutral get up mm -hmm. and also, also catch like other options as well. Well, moving into game number three, I didn't see the stage, but I'm gonna guess it's PS2. Most likely. Let's see. Yeah, here we are. <laughs> <laughs> Free thinkers when they, pick, when, when they say start PS2. <laughs> I uh, get it. That's a, it. It's a fun stage. But yeah, I think it's a really solid stage. Um, but especially for both of these characters. Sometimes maybe, maybe they want this matchup just to you know, because their other stages kind of favor towards like each other. Yeah. Towards, so they just want a fair, even match. Yeah, maybe so they can't get it with this this real set. So, yeah, maybe he doesn't necessarily want to think too much about, like, oh, how do I adapt to this other stage? Just wants to think about what their opponent's going to do. Yep. Oh, good conversion there for you to do. Yeah, pretty close. Going to uh, float high and be able to get back to stage with oh, that. No. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, his jump? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> He's still going. Oh, I think Sora J, no jump, no float. Yeah, Sora J going to still get back. Able to get back to stage. Punish there, smash attack, center stage. Good okay. grab there for Zora J. Has to watch out for that oh, turn up, and that turn up Goodbye. is going to KO. Yep. Sniped his tether once again with the turn up. Oh, Mega caught his dash back there. Yeah, immediately coming off the platform with that megawatt. Oh, I like this. I like the setup he was going there with the, the forward tilt. 
like sends at just the right angle where it can potentially set up for a tech chase on the, the platform. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, a little double. bit of turn to play. Yeah, double. It's the double hit, but it gets the trade right after. Oh, Ooh, with wait, the footstool, footstool and everything. Yeah, Sora J just showing uh, kind of the technical prowess. Yep. But okay, still weaving around each other. Yippee diddly do in the corner. Yeah. He's, do he's doing a good job of catching Sora J's landings here as well. Going for the uh, Mega Watt didn't work. Going for an up smash, trying to catch a roll, but also not working, but still so even. Oh, yeah, it's even game. It's good. Go. Whenever either one of them gets the kill move, they can just run away with the momentum. But they need to they need to hold this lead. This is a big stock here. But Yippie Diddly Do gets the first one with the late hit of the Mega Wad there. I think it was a sus DI there for mm -hmm. Sora J, but it's very this, very possible. Yeah, as long as Sora J can take the stock here, this could definitely be very doable for him. But ooh, counter oh. barely able to live there for Yippie Diddly Do. Oh! Oh my God! The double hit there from the. I think I accidentally hit my bike. That was that was yeah, gross. Yeah, yeah. That was like, yeah, the turnips just carried Yippy Diddly Do off like a stretcher. Yeah. <laughs> All right, tense game three here. Yippy Diddly Do has the advantage. Great grab there. Yeah. Is the able to send Sora J up in the air. That's exactly where you want him. But oh, does gets the weak hit. That's oh, oh triple back air. Three back airs in a row. Oh, cat catches him again on Can the Yippie ledge. Get back? Oh, he's still ready to catch him in disadvantage. Oh, that big that. That Ram Ram saved him there. This is almost dead even. The yeah, arms. Sora J is running away with momentum right now. Oh! oh smash, going to be able to take it. Sora J yeah. taking the set. Looking that stylish. Was, that was that was clean play there from Sora yeah. J. Okay. Yeah, trying to punish up, and there it is. Yippee yep, landing with a neutral air uh, ring. That's not going to be... Yeah, one uh, thing I always love about watching Sora J is that whenever he uses up smash, he always saves it for like just the right moment to where he knows you're gonna jump mm -hmm. and just punishes you so hard for it. That was, yeah. Cause he, he knew he wanted to jump past ledge there because he just wanted the momentum back and Sora J was carrying it like so, so well. Very well played there for Sora J. Yeah, I really liked it. Sora J uh, was trying to catch a jump early too. Was going for that up air right in the jump range. Yep. And Yippie didn't jump. So I like how Sora J faded right back to that like roll distance. Like I'm gonna catch roll and charge that up smash. And it just kind of worked for either scenario.